Jimmy. Jimmy, Jimmy. Listen, I'm sorry. I really am. I remember the day you got hired here several years ago. Do you remember? Yes. You were so grateful to have a job. You had been living at your parents' house since you had graduated college. I've always liked you, Jimmy. You came in, you worked hard, always did what you were told. Please, I know I can be that way again. I need you to be honest with me, Jimmy. Your music video is, um, nice. It seems pretty popular. You obviously have something different happening with your voice. But you can't work here and do this too. You're too distracted, Jimmy. You need to choose one or the other. That's what I thought. Go home, Jimmy. You're not fired, but you have until Monday morning to decide. <laughs> this life or this life. Hey, Blaze, it's Jimmy. I know, I know you're probably at work or something, but I just, I really need to talk to you. I don't, I don't know what's going on anymore, and I, don't know, I was just thinking maybe we could get dinner or. Oh my God. Okay, this is happening. Hello, Jimmy. <laughs> Hi, Beth. I can't believe we ran into each other like this. This is crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. I saw your music video. Did you get my Facebook comments? What? No. No, I didn't. Your voice. It sounds just like the video. That's really real? Yeah, it's me. It's real. Oh, my poor baby. Where are you going right now? Home. I'm just going home. I'm gonna go home with you, Jimmy. Meet you back there. Okay. Looks exactly the same as before. But what did you expect? Oh, Jimmy. Who's Liz? <clears throat> Wait. Steve's sister, Liz? <sighs> Why don't we just go in your bedroom and talk? No phones. Just you and me. Jimbalaya! Where are you at, son? You gotta call me back. I have the most amazing news to tell you. Okay, call me back. How's Geraldo and his foot-long penis? <laughs> what? Who? I don't know. Oh, Jimmy. Why, Beth? Why did you break up with me? I was scared. Scared? Scared of what? Of us. Five years together, Jimmy. Five. It's like a fifth of my whole life. The thought of living a normal nine to five for the next 60 years, it just freaked me out. But I realized I can't be without you, Jimmy. I want our normal life. You do? <laughs> I do. Yo, Jimmy, why is this door unlocked? Hello? Jimmy? No. Son of a bitch. Jimmy, man, the hell did I do? Holy crap. Hey, Steve. Hi. My off limit sister's on her way over, and she's worried about you for some reason. Looks like you're doing just fine.
So Beth left, and then Liz came over, but then Steve told Liz that Beth had been there, and Liz started crying, and then she left. Oh, yeah, and Steve and I actually found out that we have been invited to go into a local radio station tomorrow and sing our song live, which is great. Hey, Steve. Okay, so when we get back from commercial break, I'm going to introduce you guys real quick. You'll do your song, I'll ask you some questions, and then we'll open up the phone lines, take some calls. Cool? Yeah, sounds good. And we are back. All right, I've got two very special guests in the studio with me today. If you've seen their music video to their song Freak on YouTube, they'll need absolutely no introduction. It's Jimmy and Steve. Welcome. What's up? Thanks for having us. All right, and we'll have plenty of time to chat afterwards. But for right now, let's give the listeners what they want to hear. Yeah, ready. Okay, right on. For the first time live, Jimmy and Steve with their song, Freak. <clears throat> Freak, that's what they call me. Hello, Miss Stang. You looking fine with your diamond 